welcome back to Dierra's Lounge. How are you guys doing for your new years? And this is the first video of this new year, guys. I've been so busy since the year I started already. <sighs> but it just finally calmed down so I can finally sit down and do a video with you guys because, of course, while we've been all getting our new year started, I've gotten some lounge flies um but today i wanted to show you a new one that i got and some other items too that have came out um i think even before this year started um and then some from the beginning of this year that i had got you know just some things that i of being a disney fan so the first thing i wanted to show you is that i got something from the disney 100 collection is what it's called it's that silver collection that came out it's so pretty but there's one item that i had to get out of all of everything that came out for the collection and it is the starbucks cup okay i had to get this because i have the gold one and that sangria pink that came out for the u.s i have those two and i saw they were coming out with this like i saw people for like Starbucks collectors that are out there, I saw um, Instagram post about this cup and first of all, they, they just were showing pictures of it. Like they were like, it's some exclusive cup that was coming or might not be coming that they had pictures of. And I'm like, oh my God, I hope that comes out because that would be perfect to complete, com to complete the um, like shiny metallic collection. Um, like I wanted this cup so bad and then they finally they finally had said that this was coming out in the hundreds collection so I had to get it and as soon as it drops on Disney's website I went on there and I definitely got it yep and that is the bottom but this one I got Disney World because that is technically my home park is Disney World so I definitely got the Disney World version. There is a Disneyland and I have a bow on it already. And so I do get my bowls from my girl on Instagram for Starbucks because um, she does some raffles and things and she makes bowls. Her name is The Bow Pusher. I'm gonna leave her Instagram down below and a link to it. But my girl makes the best bowls and all my bowls are from her. But they are so cute like this perfectly goes with my starbucks cup like i have them sitting <laughs> i'm trying not to start collecting starbucks cups guys but i've i've already got about nine of them now um i feel like i just need to get one more maybe that's it just only 10. <laughs> but i love the starbucks cup it's so shiny it's so pretty and then i took this to my local starbucks you know to to get a drink to use it and they, and the people were like, where did you get it from? Like, they were like, we instantly noticed it as soon as you came through the door because it's so shiny. Like, it's like out right there, like in your face. And they were like, uh, and then I told them it's a Disney one because it has the Disney uh, logo on the back. So I was like, it's a Disney one. And it's, I, then I checked and these are still available on shopdisney.com guys so if you want one go grab it it is so freaking cute and it's so shiny um and then i think when i last saw in there they actually had a code that you could save now because i got this when it first came out so i spent the coin the the actual price on them these are 50 dollars by by the way so i spent the the 50 to get it and um right now they do have a sale that's going on so you can save some money on getting a starbucks cup because i know that's kind of expensive for a cup but i had to get it like i if it's something that i can use like on a daily or anything like that i don't mind spending the money for it it's it's like something that's going to last like i have this feet i could have this for years so i don't mind spending the coin on it but i think it's so cute yep and it came up with that 100th disney collection and then another item I have gotten this year, cause you know guys, I love like older cartoons and movies and things like that. Like I know I'm a, I'm, I'm young, I'm 28. So, but I love all the classics, okay? So like, I love Snoopy. I love like, um, 
this like older, really pretty much older shows like the Snorks and the Smurfs and Flintstones and the Jetsons. Like I, I love all of that. And there's another show that I really love. That I really hate that they took away and I wish it would come back and I got a shirt for it. But I got a shirt for strawberry shortcake and it is like the original strawberry shortcake i had to get it okay it's so cute like look at i love the original strawberry shortcake like i know they did a remake of her but i love the original and they had a show there was a show that was out there was the older strawberry shortcake and it's so cute and i love it and i got this at box lunch by the way shout out to box lunch always coming up with the vibes of like i they're they're like i don't know they're like my favorite store to go to now because they have everything like me as a as a collector and everything could ask for like i love anime they always have all the anime shows shirts hats anything you could ask for and then they always they just come out with things like this like classics like old classics they have the snoopy items like box lunch and they'll have lot and they have lounge flies. It's like an all-in-one shop for me at Box Lunch. <laughs> okay, so I got this at Box Lunch. It's so very sweet and so very cute. I just love it. It's so cute. But I love that. I love that. And it has her friends. And I think cupcakes on here. Yep, cupcakes on here. Her um cat is called Cupcake. Oh, it's so cute. I can't wait to wear it. It still has a tax on it. I can't wait. And I think this is, they had another design for Shirley Shirt Cake. And it's still probably at Box Lunch. Or you can find it on boxlunch.com. Um, but yeah, guys. I think that's so cute. I love my classics, you know. And speaking of New Year's, guys. I There's another New Year that's being celebrated. And it's the Chinese New Year. It is the New Year for the and I believe if I'm getting that correct it is the year of the chicken and of course I got the Mulan lounge fly the Mulan sequin lounge fly I remember guys I told you with princesses is I really had to get like what was on my list of the Disney, Disney princess sequins collection that like had to come out and this was Mulan was one of them like I I had she's like one of my she's one of my favorites um of course you know Belle is my absolute favorite but the, the Mulan is like second or third on my list and I just had to get the sequence for her it's so pretty so pretty and shiny and this is her dress that she wear that she wears when she goes to the matchmaker like I think that's so cute like the lily the lily is so pretty the lily comb that they have on there and the black is pink I think that's so pretty and then the zipper pull is um red new shoes <laughs> that's so cute like a little medallion but yeah that's her dress this is her dress for when she goes to meet the matchmaker and then we have the green straps and then on the back, it says, true to who I am, which is Mulan Sane. I think that's so pretty. Okay. And then let's see the inside of it. And if you're new to my channel, definitely make sure that you like this video. Subscribe. I'm always here, you know, as a Disney collector, mostly lounge flies. And I'm a sneaky collector of anything for lounge flies. I love sneaky. Um, but let me show you the inside of this Mulan lounge fly. Look at that. Isn't that so pretty? Like the design of it that they put in here. Let's see if I can get another angle so you can really see it. I think that is a gorgeous. So it's her comb and then we'll, the medallion kind of, kind of piece with Mushu and then the sword. Like her father's sword that she takes to the to be trained with to battle i think that's so pretty i love that you know my favorite color is blue so that was a nice surprise to see that was the color of the inside of it 
and it has a pocket. It's not a zipper pocket. It's one of the flat pockets on the inside. But you know, a pocket is a pocket. It still keeps you organized. So yeah, and I do have the matching wallet. So let me show you that. So here's the matching wallet. It is just like the bag where the front is her dress design. This is leather and it has the beautiful comb. I love this. And it has like actual teeth like the comb, like a comb that's so pretty. And it's that pink on the back with some blue sequins. I love the contrast too. Like I love that it's like green and then you got like a blue kind of teal turquoise kind of color and then a pink. I love that contrast. I don't know about it. It's really pretty. But it opens like this with a snap. I'm sorry, it has tissue in it because still I have not used it. And it has this has the sword. Yeah, it has the sword design for like your ID holder, card holders, and it has the same print as inside the backpack. And room for your money. I think that's so pretty. And I love that. I love these wallets. The ones that just snap. You snap it close. Because it has two, it has two snaps. So it has a, the strap that actually goes over top. And it has a snap right here that closes it. So your money is secure in these wallets. I love these. And they're not big. Um, I hate big people. Them big giant wallets. I don't like them. But this is really cute. It's really pretty. So yeah, I've added Mulan to my collection. So so far I have four of the Disney Princess Sequence collection. And um guys, um, they just recently came out with Rapunzel. I was looking at Rapunzel. I'm not really into Rapunzel, but it was a very pretty bag. I might get it later on. I know it's going to be expensive if I do because it's going to be um, people selling it. Um, but I was also looking at getting Cinderella too because I missed out on her. And I really wanted a, that Cinderella because it's a very pretty blue. Um, so I'm going to probably get her um, more than likely. But I, Rapunzel just came out and it was a very pretty purple and pink. It was very cute. But I was still trying to decide on if I wanted her or not by the time it came out so I missed out on that one but we'll still if I wanted I'll you know I'll get it <laughs> if I wanted I get it <laughs> okay but that is all for today guys I just wanted to show you a couple things that I got to start out kind of like start out my new year um but I hope you guys are enjoying your new year you know setting goals I don't really set new year resolutions because most of the time you never really stick to them. I set goals for myself. Goals are more set and they are more something that you can really obtain to. Like you can set your goal and you're like, okay, this is what I have to do to get to my goal. Um, so I set, I set goals for the year and I just made sure that I put steps in place like at a certain period of time that I have to get to this point for me to be able to get here. So I hope you guys have set some new goals for this year and good luck to you in completing them i hope you do whatever you're looking for this new year go for it okay go for what you want and um everyone stay healthy and i just hope you guys enjoy this new year um you know and i know it's been a struggle you know prices are going up but you know Try to not let things really get you because they're mostly in the moment kind of things. Um, and just like, strive through it, okay? I know it's, it gets hard sometimes, but strive through it. Be positive, set those goals, go for it, okay? Go be a go-getter, okay? Don't be procrastinators, be a go-getter. Go get what you want, okay? But I hope you guys enjoy the new year and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.